I have this little widget in there called selling, which yep. is, hey, um, I know that I want this person. How do I make the job <laughs> offer to them? Yeah. So the sales process starts in the actual interview process. So mm -hmm. before you want to make the offer, sales has already been starting. Mm -hmm. So the sales starts with them reading your vivid vision, the four or five page description of your company in the future, right? The sales process starts by getting them to tell you why they love your vivid vision and why they can help it make it come true. They're now selling themselves on being inside the company. 20% mm -hmm. of the first interview is selling. It's reversing the sell. It's, it's, it's asking them tougher questions, raising the bar, saying, look, this is gonna be the toughest fucking thing I think you've ever done. I'm not sure you're gonna be good at it. Like, why do you think I'm wrong? It's asking those kinds of questions in an OG shucks way that gets the candidate selling themselves into the role, right? When you go to the second interview, it's 50% interviewing, 50% selling, but again, reversing the sell. And then when you're into the torque side, the thread of reference check, the A candidates, and I haven't even explained how that works yet, but the A candidates are working so hard to sell you that they're in by the time you make the offer, right? I used to have a joke back in the college pro painters days that I could put a pen and a piece of paper down in front of them, their contract to sign, and they'd be reaching for the pen and I'd pick it up before them and they'd be itching to grab the paper, right? So by the time you make the offer, you already know they're pre-sold that it's not even about trying to sell them anymore because you've built that into your system. So you're right that there's sales, but I think it has to come throughout, throughout the process. Then the way I make the offer, and I've always done it the same way. Brad, I got some good news and some bad news. Which would you like first? And whichever way they go, the bad news is, this is gonna be the hardest fucking thing you've ever done. The good news is, congratulations, you're gonna be working with us. I don't even offer, I just say congratulations, you're in. Mm. And I kind of play the game, and I do that with like, $300,000 people or $50,000 people.